Hey there folks, I'm Lane and this is Techno Maverick. Today we're going to be taking a look at my favorite desktop utility apps for Windows 10. First up is one of my absolute favorites. It's called Flux or F.Lux. There have been studies that have shown that the blue light from your various screens disrupts your sleeping patterns. It messes with your biological rhythm. So what Flux does is it modifies the color temperature of your display after the sun goes down, which supposedly will make it easier for you to fall asleep if you've been using your screen within just a couple of hours of when it's time to go to sleep. Now, even if Flux doesn't actually help you get to sleep faster or help you sleep better, it's still great because it makes it more comfortable for you to use your screen when it's dark in the room. Before I get into the next app, I wanna mention that later on in this video, I'm going to introduce you to an application that is just going to blow your mind if you use a Windows 10 PC that has a touch screen. So stick around for that. Next up is an app called Push Bullet, something that I use absolutely every single day. Now it's an app that has been around for a while and depending on what phone you use, what phone operating system you use, it will have varying degrees of usefulness to you. Originally what Push Bullet was designed to you and what it still does quite well is it allows you to share files, folders, strings of text, links, things like that between devices. You can also use it as a messaging platform. So you install Push Bullet on your Android or iOS device and then also on your Windows 10 PC and then you can just basically drag and drop anything into there and then have that available on all those different devices. Push Bullet is especially useful if you have an Android phone because with an Android phone you're actually able to receive and send text messages directly from your Windows PC. So you can see full message threads right on your Windows 10 PC and manage all of your SMS messages and MMS messages from your Windows 10 PC. They even have this neat little chat heads feature where you can kind of have those messages or those message threads floating above whatever app you're using so that you constantly have access to those messages. Next up we have Microsoft Snip. Now built into Windows 10 there are a few different ways that you can take screenshots but Microsoft Snip makes this a little bit more accessible. It puts an always present toolbar either at the top of the screen or wherever else you want to have it and then you can just go ahead and click to take a screenshot. In addition to taking those screenshots you're also then able to annotate and then share those right from Microsoft Snip. Next up we have Sizer. Now if you're someone who is just very very particular about having their Windows desktop look clean and tidy, um, Sizer is going to be great for you. If you constantly find yourself adjusting the sizes of your windows to make them look right, Sizer is going to be perfect. Basically what it does is it installs this custom right click menu. So when you right click on the border of, an, of a windowed application, it's going to give you options for different sizes that you can choose and you can create your own custom sizes. When you select that size, it automatically resizes that application so that all of those applications will be the correct size. As I mentioned before, this last app is going to blow your mind if you have a Windows 10 touchscreen device. Now I just want to mention that this channel is dedicated to helping you get the most out of whatever technology you own. So if you'd like to see more content like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button that's on the screen now. Have you ever wished that you could have iPad style gestures on your Windows 10 tablet? I know that I have and this app is perfect for that because what it lets you do is actually create your own gesture shortcuts for the touch screen. So imagine being able to swipe up with two fingers to show the keyboard and then swipe down with two fingers to go ahead and hide it. Or what if you could do like a dial turning motion on the screen and actually turn the volume up and down? Well that's all possible with Touch Me Gesture Studio. In my next video I'm going to show you some incredible things that Cortana can do on your Windows 10 PC and I wouldn't be surprised if you didn't know that a lot of these functions were there. So if you don't want to miss that video, be sure to hit the subscribe button you see on the screen now. Thanks for watching.